I was in the middle of washing my face and I was like, I need to grab the camera. We're going to do a day in the life today. So that's what you guys are getting. Um, I really don't know what I have planned for today. Like honestly, no plans right now. I'm getting ready for the day. I'm going to head into town. I'm going to stop at Starbucks because I really love their new chocolate cream cold brew drink. And I haven't gotten coffee out in a well, I got coffee like two days ago, but other than that, like I haven't been getting Starbucks or anything like that. So I'm like, I'm gonna treat myself, it's Friday. And then I do wanna stop at a nursery because I wanna get some mint leaves to plant. I'm trying to look for like a hanging plant um, to put a new one on the door and then I can put the flower that's on the door somewhere else because I just feel like it's not thriving there. I don't really have anything else planned i have to do a workout later and yeah so you guys are going to come along with me today here we have our little pail garden we have our peppers in here and then over here we have, down there is beans. We have some herbs here and cucumbers. We finally got a little pool for our ducks yesterday. So I have to fill this up and then actually we should probably get it in the coop or in the run and then fill it up because otherwise it's gonna be a hot mess trying to get it back there. But here's our garden. Planted a ton of lettuce, arugula and lettuce over there. Brussels sprouts, cauliflower, kale, celery, tomatoes, potatoes, onions. Actually, potatoes aren't over here. But Brussels sprouts, you guys know we love those. And broccoli is over there. Okay, so I got my coffee and it is amazing. I really recommend if you guys ever go to a Starbucks, the chocolate cream cold brew. So, so good. Um, but I'm going to show you guys what I got from the nursery. Watch out, Skeeter. Can you, can you come up here? Come on, come on, yeah, okay. I picked up this little planter and then I also got this mojito mint. Yesterday I had a iced LaCroix or had some LaCroix with ice in it and I was like, oh, this would be a little bit better if it had some mint leaves in it. And so I was like, oh my God, I can't believe I never got mint leaves when we went and got all of our herbs and stuff. So pick this up, I'm gonna plant it when I get home. I also got cilantro because I love Mexican food. I love making salsa. I love making pico, all of that stuff. And so I thought I could um, plant this so we have cilantro on hand at home. Every morning at 5 a.m. the chickens are non-stop squawking so loud. It's like my alarm clock. They wake me up every morning. Do you guys want to come out? Come on. <laughs> I am so hungry, but I don't know what I want to make for breakfast. Like I want everything. I want yogurt. I want oatmeal. I want eggs. I want breakfast tacos. Like I just want everything. But what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to make some scrambled eggs. So then Skeeter can have some eggs too. And then I'm going to do a slice of avocado toast. Wait, I have avocados, right? Oh yeah, I do. And maybe like a banana on the side. I don't know. I just like, I want everything but I just don't want to make it. So that's where I'm at, but I'm going to get some scrambled eggs going because I'm super hungry. We'll see, we'll, we'll see what I end up making. How about that? We'll see what you guys will just have to wait and see. Oh my gosh. I wanted to tell you guys. So yesterday I made a super yummy, like little dessert cookie and it's very healthy. So what it is, it's oats, um, maple syrup, cacao powder, and what else? There's one more thing. Oh, almond butter. Or I use peanut butter. I use the, I forget what brand it is, but it's just, it's just peanuts. Um, it's not made with any like oil or sugar or anything. And then I put some walnuts and chocolate chips in. Oh my God. I'm going to show you guys what it looks like because it was so good. And it's like such a healthy little treat. So it looks like this. It was delicious. If you guys have a sweet tooth like I do, but you don't want to eat Oreos or you don't want to like... You want to have something semi-healthy and like good for you. Oh, I added chia seeds in here too. Um, 
but make these. I'll add the recipe um, either on the screen or in the description. It's so good. And I literally just threw them together. Like I really didn't measure. I just was like, oh yeah, that's probably about the right amount. That's the right amount. Um, so yeah, so good. 10 out of 10, really recommend. And then I just put them in the freezer so they stay uh, frozen. But you could obviously just put it in the fridge. So I'm going to do one egg for me and two eggs for Skeeter because he's spoiled. Well, the chickens spoil us. That's what it is. But Skeeter does not like yolk, so I'm going to have to break his yolks. I love yolks. I love yolky eggs. Do you want some eggs? Do you want some eggs? I'm really on like a health kick here. Um, not for like any reason. Honestly, I just want to get like, I just want to be healthy, you know, like I am really aware of like what I put in my body and what I feel my body with. And especially the, like nowadays, you can't trust anything. And so I'm just like, well, all I can control right now is what I put into my body. That's what's been going on with me. I've also been doing a workout every single day. I join Form. Uh, it's like an online it's an app basically it's like it's basically like a membership um that you pay for you can either do monthly or yearly and she provides workouts for you anyway so yeah i've been doing that a lot of you guys have been asking for like a workout routine and honestly like i never provided one because i didn't have a workout routine but i used to be really big into like going to the gym every single day like before we moved here I was a part of a local gym, I went to spin classes every day, or like yoga, or I'd go to open gym and just do like cardio and strengthening exercises, and then when we moved here, um, I joined a like Pilates center, and then I stopped going because I'm just so, so busy with dance and just life, and Kyle and I always traveling, just going to places, going to the log cabin, doing things, and so I stopped going to that. Hold on, I need to get my eggs before... They overcook <laughs> so yeah when i stopped going to that and then we joined another gym and we never really went but we just we stay active around the house so like it wasn't like oh we're i'm not doing anything but i wasn't doing as much as i liked or i would have liked to do and so i joined this um this form like online fitness app and I've been loving it and like I've actually been doing it and I feel really good and so um, that's kind of my like fitness routine workout routine now okay everyone this is what I have came up with cottage cheese with pepper and then avocado toast with an over easy egg and I topped it with salt pepper and crushed red peppers so this is a breakfast don't judge my favorite plate I always get comments like what's the point of using paper plate the point is, is, I don't have to wash dishes, especially when we don't have running water. So thank you very much. I'm gonna go eat my breakfast now. It's also not even warm anymore because I also had to do an Instagram story. If you guys follow me on Instagram, thank you. If you don't, go follow me at Sierra Meyerberg. But Skeeter already ate his breakfast. His plate's clean. Good boy. So yeah, I'm gonna go eat my breakfast now. I knew I should have brought bug spray. Ow, oh my god, I'm already getting bit up. We'll see how long this lasts. We might have to... Yep, I think we're gonna have to turn around and go home and get bug spray. Literally, the car's right there. We've been walking 0.01 miles and um, I'm already getting bit up. I knew I should have brought bug spray. So we're gonna turn around, go home, get bug spray. I knew I should have brought some, but I didn't. We made it back home and I got some bug spray on, but Skeeter wants to play ball instead. So I'm gonna throw the ball for him for a little bit and then we're gonna go to the gas station to get gas for the generator to charge up the EcoFlow. I just made lunch, so I made leftover spaghetti that I made last night. I have a LaCroix. This is the cherry lime flavor. So that's what I'm drinking. And then I made just a salad with 
spring mix, onions, tomatoes, red peppers, sunflower seeds, and then I made a homemade little dressing. It has lemon, olive oil, rice vinegar, garlic, salt, and I think that's it. So I'm gonna dig in whatever I don't eat of this, Skeeter's gonna get. He's just laying right there with his ball. But I'm gonna dig in and have some lunch. Hello everyone, it is Saturday. I was gonna say Saturday morning, it's actually Saturday at like noon. Um, I totally forgot to video last night, but we didn't do anything like fun last night. But this morning I woke up and I had some coffee and then I went to the gym and then I just wanted to do like a little walk on the treadmill for a little rest day. I could have walked around outside, but the mosquitoes are just so bad. And it was also kind of gloomy, rainy. So I was like, I'm just gonna go to the gym. So I did, and then I went to the farmer's market and I wanted to show you guys what I got. So I picked up this artesian white bread. And then I also got Asiago bagels. And then I also got this chocolate banana bread. It won't focus. I wanted to show you guys this cute wash stand that my grandma gave me she came over the other day and brought it here but i decorated it cutely with these cabin books i'm gonna put some candy in there or some little snack in here we put our movies and then in here we just have like random stuff right now it's a lot of just electronics so yeah i really really love how it looks here because sitting on the deck in the direct sunlight, so hot, I'm sweating. I had to change my shirt because I was like, I can't, I can't, it's just too hot for this oversized t-shirt. I just did a little bit of journaling and I did some gold dumping. Um, I'm reading Ed Milet's The Power of One More book and it's so good, I really recommend it. But it really has me inspired to get back into like journaling and like just goal setting and how important that is to like really increase and like excel in life and like hit your goals or like at least work towards your goals here's an up close view of the salad it's so good 20 out of 10 recommend you trying this and obviously <laughs> obviously you guys can add like things that you like in your salad but this is all the things that i like to add here is the chicken sandwich i have some chicken breast with munster cheese on it then I put some red onions and jalapenos, and then I topped it with avocado and some sriracha aioli, and then I have arugula with a little drizzle of olive oil and Himalayan salt. And then I have some kettle barbecue chips. Here's dinner with my LaCroix. Kyle has like a double decker over there. Pretty good. So I just got done with dinner. So now I think I'm gonna watch a little bit of YouTube and watch some YouTube videos and then um, read a little bit of my book. I've been reading, I actually just started a new like thriller. It's called The Turn, Turn the Key, The Turn of the Key, um, yesterday. I'm gonna read some of that on my iPad and then I might check in with you guys in a little while. Maybe I'm, I'm gonna make like a bedtime snack or something. I told you guys I would end up having a bedtime snack. It, what time is it? It's like 8 something, 8.23. So I am having some cereal and then I put some bananas and chocolate chips on it to just spice it up a little bit. Also we have some bananas that need to be eaten so I decided to cut some up. But here's my bedtime snack. Good morning, everybody. It is Sunday morning. I just um, finished up my little morning routine. I read a little bit of The Power of One More, and then I also had some coffee. I'm taking my probiotic. I seriously love this brand so much. I post about it on my Instagram, and I get a lot of questions. I do have a code if you guys want to try it out and get some money off. The code is Sierra, but I have always just had like stomach problems, digestion problems, and so I take this because it just, it really does help with digestion and going to the bathroom regularly and it just makes me feel good so um i take it it's the just thrive brand but yeah so 
skier has been waiting and waiting for me to take him outside so that's what i'm gonna go do i'm gonna go throw the ball for him and journal but i'm gonna end the video here thank you guys so much for watching more videos are coming um and i do have a busy month coming up in july dance camps will be starting so i'm gonna do my best to try to get up some content while i'm away um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and don't forget to subscribe to see more videos on this channel